Well, the foundation was created by John DeHaan, a businessman who unfortunately was stricken with a heart attack in 1979 at the young age of 39 years. Having successful bypass surgery, he set out to educate himself about cardiac health and immediately learned that the functional life expectancy of his new bypass grafts was disappointingly short. This motivated John to begin funding cardiac research. And as fate would have it, John's investment in research would end up benefiting him personally because several years after his bypass, he would need another procedure in which he received a stent that in part his early funding helped develop. John will celebrate his 81st birthday in a few months, something that seemed unimaginable back in 1979. He realizes it is hard won technological advancements and the medical professionals who delivered them that allowed him to live his full life. The John D. Hahn Foundation Award for Innovation in Cardiology is John's way to give back to the medical community that has given him so much. That's a, that's a very good question. There is no specific thing we're looking for. Uh, Mr. DeHaan is a huge supporter of innovation. So any, uh, any innovation in the cardiac space uh, was acceptable. We don't uh, want to limit ourselves. There may be some very interesting areas that, uh, that could be excluded if we had set arbitrary criteria. So we really do not want to do that. We want to keep as uh, open as we can. And certainly when you think about innovation, in many cases, the most innovative projects are something that's uh, completely unexpected. <music>